Can you talk about that punt return that you had? Yeah, um, it was late in the half, and uh, we had a middle return called. And you know, uh, the, the kicker, we knew we were going to get some chances this week with uh, with this punter because uh, he was prone to out kick his coverage. And you know, he gave us a, sh a shot, and you know, our, our middle of the field, our guys held held him up real well. And uh, as a punt returner, you, you're supposed to make at least one guy miss. And you know, we were fortunate enough to do that, and guys held on their blocks, and we executed the play. It was a good run, or a good play. When did you know you were clear? I knew once when I was uh, pressing back, and I was going to put my foot in the ground and cut back. I knew uh, we were going we were going to hit the house right there. Julian, after what happened with the Bears game in Chicago, mm -hmm. how much were you thinking about that? After you crossed the goal line? I'm not going to lie. I was, I was, I was actually thinking about that, and uh, you know, I was thinking I was I'm going to look like a like a like an idiot going up into those stands if there's a flag out there. So, uh, but um, you know we, we didn't fortunately, and uh, we got we got the the touchdown finally. I mean it's been different, but um, you know I'm I'm just happy to be here and help contribute to the team in any way possible and uh my role has changed a little bit this year um, I had to take on the punt returning role a little more to get my plays and um you know whatever the coaches ask me to do I'm, I'm gonna do because you know they've, they've given me op my opportunity to play in this league and you know I feel like uh I'm, th I'm very thankful for that yeah I mean whatever you put on film that's you so um you know, I mean, I, I prepare every week like I'm going to play because you're only a play away from playing in this game. And, uh, you know, we, we really didn't know what was going on. Um, and uh, it was, you know, it was, it was great to have the opportunity. On the second TD drive, Tom went to you twice in a row. The second time, I don't know if I could see from uh, the platoon, uh, you went through just about everybody got to the goal line almost. Yeah, I know. I mean, how, how badly were you trying to get over I mean, very badly. Yeah. I mean, it would have been nice, but uh, we, we set up the, the team to get in there, and, you know, it was, it was good to get the touchdown. Next play. Uh, Coach, we've seen, we've seen you talking to the game. Is that anything beyond nice game? Though? No, that's all he said. It's a man of few words. <laughs> Julian, at any time during the season, was your confidence affected because you weren't able to put anything on film, you know, this year until now? Uh. I wouldn't say it was affected. It was just, uh, it's, it's, it was difficult. Um, you know, I was still adjusting to coming in for certain roles, and I'm still adjusting, and, you know, I still got to get better every day I, doing my job and coming in here and, and going in one play maybe in the fourth quarter that you haven't been in all game, and you got you to you make, make a big catch or you got to make a first down or run or something. So, uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to be working on that this whole, this whole week. That we have off, and uh, you know, hopefully, we get better at that. So it's a 94 yard return of PR for you, personal best? I mean, I've only been returning punts for two years, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, Do you feel better prepared for that situation you talked about? You know, if you're around it, what somebody would kind of do better prepared for that after today? You can't get some time I mean, gosh, I guess um, still, I still got to work at it more. Um, so. We'll see you this next week. How different was the tempo uh, and the huddle to the right end of that? Uh, you know, it's it's a little different, but Brian does a, a real good job. I mean, Brian is always in is in Tom's back pocket. He's always following, doing everything he does. Wears the same clothes as Tom. Drives the same kind of car as Tom. Uh, you know, if Tom has a vitamin water, you know, you'll see Brian with a vitamin water or something like that, and. You know, it's 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 funny, but you know, Brian does an awesome job, and he goes in there and he he works so hard all week. Um, whether it's on scout team, he's gonna he's gonna lead that that little group, and he's gonna take it like it's a game. So, you know, whatever Brian does, he deserves because he works his tail off. The debate all week seems to be rest guys versus maintaining momentum going into the playoffs. Is it fair to say you guys were a little tough both of those today? I mean. I guess. I mean, the score was pretty 
we, we scored some points and we did some good things. We go got to go back and watch the film and you know get get better and you know work work towards it this next week. I don't even think we thought about that. You know, we were thinking about Cincinnati, our first game, and probably we were thinking about the pre-first preseason game against the Saints. So, you know, that's that's how we thought about it. At least that's how I thought about it.